Welcome. Today I have a six bedroom house on just over 1.5 rye on the southern tip of May Rim to show you. The surroundings are still very nice and rural, but this is actually a quickly developing area in May Rim with lots of cafes, restaurants, and uh, everything else going up because of the flower farm industry. This house has a great location, just 10 minutes or so from Rumchok and maybe 15 minutes from Central Festival. You can see the plot here. It's a long plot. You've got a area in back which is used as an orchard currently. Lots of fruit trees there. And then the area up front which is a beautiful yard leading to the main entrance. Give you an idea of the surroundings and you've got a great mountain view in the distance. We're coming up to the main entrance from the front yard. The driveway to the parking runs along the side there at the right. You need to think about this house is it really has a granite entrance. That's pretty rare here in Chiang Mai. Usually you just have a small foyer if you've got one at all. Here you've got this two level really grand entrance, floor to ceiling windows, looking out over the front yard. You've got a nice arched window at the entrance and then the split levels up and down. Upstairs the bedrooms and I'll take you to the living area first. The living slash dining area on the first floor it's really got a very open and light feel. You've got these very nice windows, great open space, not blocked by any sort of concrete columns or pillars. And you can see it's nicely furnished in sort of a Scandinavia modern style. You have three rooms off of the living room area. They can be used as offices, a gym, or a bedroom if you like. This is the guest bathroom. Full bathroom with a shower. All the rooms have a nice parquet wood floor. This is the storage area, just off of the entryway, in the back. And this is a newly renovated kitchen they've added on a few years ago. Spent about half a million baht, completely restoring the kitchen, making a nice modern style. Good light, windows on two sides. Coming up onto the second floor, you have a small entertainment or lounge area. Be an office or home gym as well. And then you have the four guest bedrooms and two shared bathrooms along either side of the hallway. I'll take you back here. And this is the master bedroom at the end of the hallway. There's a good amount of space, quite a long room. There's a small ensuite balcony and the ensuite bathroom. The guest bedrooms are, are all pretty similar. There are two rooms with a shared bathroom between them. And the same thing on the other side, same setup. The bedroom on either side and the shared bathroom. This is in the back of the house. You've got a little patio, sitting, dining out there in the back, covered by the master bedroom's balcony, covered parking for four cars, and this barbecue area at the back.